This is the emergency department in Wuhan Zhongnan Hospital. Here is the waiting area. Here is the observation room. The medical staff in the emergency departments were increased by 30% recently to tackle the increase in demand. And there is the resuscitation room. Well, let's go back to the waiting area. Quite a few people can be seen queuing up here, and many of them are waiting to see doctors. This time, there are a huge increase in the among those severely ill patients, most of them are elderly with underlying diseases. 90 years old Chu Fu Chang is one of those waiting to receive treatment, and his son feels anxious. In a bid to leave no patients unattended, the emergency department has been trying to make the most of the building's space. This used to be an emergency observation room. As you can see, it has been converted to a buffer zone for critically ill patients to stay so as to reduce their waiting time. Luckily, Chu Fu Chang was soon transferred into this buffer zone to get medical care. <laughs> After receiving first aid treatments, Chu Fu Cheng's condition soon saw some improvement. To ensure that as many patients as possible are treated, all medical personnel have worked around clock with full combat effectiveness. Tian Yu is the head nurse here. She has just requested to accelerate the Grand Channel creation for hospital admissions. She told me the bad numbers in the resuscitation room where she works have recently increased from 7 to 15 to accommodate the overflow. To shorten the waiting time for space on the ward, hospitals across the country have been increasing their intensive care capacity. Zhongnan Hospital has doubled its ICU beds, and Chu Fu Chang has just been informed that he will be hospitalized in one of those wards soon. Knowing his father can be admitted takes a weight off his shoulders. Just like their patient's family members, medical workers are determined to save every life, regardless of age or difficulty. Huang Chang, CGTN, Wuhan, Hubei Province.